meet the 13 year old boy trapped in a toddler's body. Hello guys and welcome back to Inform Overload, I'm Rebecca Felgate and I'm hitting you up with today's news where we're going to be talking about one seriously inspiring young man. Angus Palms was born totally normal at 6 pounds and 7 ounces, however he stopped growing when he was 3. Now 10 years later since his growth stopped, he weighs just 2 stone and 2 pounds, which is just under 13 kilos. He is just 3 foot 1 inches tall, which is the height you would expect from a toddler. Angus appeared on British television show this morning with his mother to raise awareness and talk about his issue. Despite his condition which is caused by a mutated chromosome, Angus won the audience over with his warmth, laughter and cheeky glint in his eyes. He can only communicate with hand gestures, but it's clear that he understands what is going on around him. He's such an enthusiastic guy. His mother, Tandy Palms, accidentally described another chromosome condition, Down syndrome, as being bog standard when trying to explain how rare her son's condition is. Many felt that this was a poor choice of words, but I understand that actually she was just trying to highlight that most people are aware of conditions like Down syndrome, but when it comes to Angus's issues, they don't really have an understanding. While a million children in the United Kingdom have disabilities, Angus is the only known child on the British Isles facing this issue. In fact, he could be the only child in the world. Tandy said that people don't recognise his condition and they often struggle to get service and the help that they need. While Angus is usually very happy and chirpy, his mother did say that he can get very frustrated from time to time as he actually lacks the ability to communicate his feelings properly. Angus is being described as a pint sized warrior and his mother has said that his fun loving personality and his bravery have won him many fans and his doctors. Despite enjoying Angus for his outlook, Tandy did admit that doctors are absolutely baffled by his stunted growth. They say that they've never seen an issue like his before. Tandy referred to it as a 1 in 7 billion condition. While this may be true, there have been others with similar kinds of issues in the past. For example, in 2015, the Daily Mail ran an article about a 26 year old South Korean man who looked like a boy. Now reportedly, he suffered from something called Highlander syndrome, which could be similar to Angus's syndrome. So a big shout out to Angus. Although his life may be difficult, I really hope that he continues to be positive and happy about the life he is living. So before we end this video, I just really wanted to quickly reply to some comments on a video I did on this channel last week. It was a pretty exciting video about proof that Elvis is alive. Is he out there? I mean, I hope so. Kylie Boyum says, My grandma loves Elvis Presley. She has a picture of him in her house. Not only that, she attempted to get a tattoo of him. She's too nervous. The needle never touched her skin. I mean, that is dedication even if she never went through with it. Shout out to Kyle's grandma. Whereas Anthony Gamer 9512 says, I don't know any Elvis songs. Anthony, where have you been? I could do you a medley. Okay. We're caught in a trap. I can't walk out. Because I love you too much, don't step on my blue suede shoes. Yes, I'm here all day. Um, let me know if you want a full video of an Elvis medley, because I can do it for you. So guys, that is the end of the video. Let me know what you thought to this story. Let me know all of that in the comments section down below, and I'll try and respond to a few comments too. For now, I'm Rebecca Felgate covering for Charlotte Dobre. If you like this video, make sure you give it a good thumbs up, share it with a friend, and stay subscribed to IO for more daily news. I'll see you next time.